सी लेट स्टार्ट विद द कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल दैट इज द मे 2018 का क्वेश्चन है रिगार्डिंग मीन्स चलिए गो थ्रू करते इसको क्या है क्या नहीं है लेट्स गो थ्रू इट ओके आयन लिमिटेड इनवॉइस गुड इनवॉइस गुड्स टू इट्स ब्रांच एट कॉस्ट प्लस थर्टी फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग पर्टिकुलर प्रिपेयर ब्रांच स्टॉक अकाउंट ब्रांच स्टॉक एडजस्टमेंट अकाउंट एंड ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट एज दे वुड एपियर इन द बुक्स ऑफ हेड ऑफिस आई एम रिपीटिंग आयन लिमिटेड इनवॉइस गुड्स टू इट्स ब्रांच एट कॉस्ट प्लस थर्टी थ्री परसेंट ओके फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग पर्टिकुलर प्रिपेयर ब्रांच स्टॉक अकाउंट ब्रांच स्टॉक एडजस्टमेंट अकाउंट एंड ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट एज दे वुड एपियर इन द बुक्स ऑफ एच सो इन दिस केस ना द क्वेश्चन बिकम टू मच इजी फॉर अस एज टू वाई द क्वेश्चन इट्स गिवेन द अकाउंट टू बी प्रिपेयर सो वी नीड नॉट टू थिंक फ्रॉम आर ओन परस्पेक्टिव दैट विच अकाउंट वी नीड टू प्रिपेयर रेदर देन सो हेयर ब्रांच स्टॉक शुड बी प्रिपेयर Branch adjustment to should be prepared and the branch P and A should be prepared. So these three are required. From branch stock, we can get easily the surplus of stock. Okay, shortage of stock. Branch stock adjustment GP and branch P net NP. Okay, now the information given that is stock at commencement at branch at IP three lakh sixty thousand. Stock at close at branch at IP two lakh eighty eight thousand. Goods sent to the branch during the year at invoice price. Okay, so see invoice price is given. Including goods at invoiced at 40th into the branch on 31st March 18, but not received by branch before close of the. It means what? Out of 24 lakh rupees of goods, there is an goods uh, amount to rupees 40,000 at invoice price, which is still lying in the road. It means goods in transit, because if you see it clearly, that is sent it on the close closing of the date, but is yet to be received by the branch. Okay. So it means the year closed, but the goods is yet to be received. Means it is on the road. So that's why it is called, sir, goods in transit. That is, it is called goods in transit. Clear? Hai? Acha. Next. Iske baat kya dekhi, guys? After this, you can say that uh, return of goods to HO invoice price one lakh twenty thousand. Credit sale at branch one lakh twenty thousand. Invoice value of goods bill for twenty four thousand. Normal loss at branch due to wastage and deterioration of stock at invoice price thirty six thousand. Cash sale at branch twenty one lakh sixty thousand. So these are very easy. Uh, but here the C in this particular question, if you uh, give importance from the uh, like uh, from the second of the last part, okay, the normal loss at branch due to wastage and deterioration of stock at IP and the invoice value of goods bill for. So goods bill for is nothing but the abnormal loss. But the goods lost due to the normal reason, it will be a normal loss. So these are the two basic information that we have regarding this particular aspect. Correct. So let's we have all the information regarding this. So let's start. करते guys. तीनो account मुझे open करना है. One is called the branch stock and one is called sorry uh, branch stock adjustment and the branch PNN. Okay. So these three account I need to prepare. Clear cut. Okay. तो चलिए इसको प्रिपेयर कर लेते एक बार फटाक से प्लीज ओपन द लेजर के फटाक से लेजर काट लीजिए गाइस एवरीवन प्लीज मार्क लेजर ब्रांच स्टॉक का एक लेजर होगा ओके ब्रांच स्टॉक एडजस्टमेंट का एक लेजर होगा एज वेल एज ब्रांच पीएनएल का एक लेजर होगा सो थ्री लेजर वी नीड बेसिकली डोंट डू एनी डेट कॉलम रादर जस्ट सिंपली वी हैव पर्टिकुलर डेट पर्टिकुलर डेट दैट्स ऑल ओके वन सिंगल कॉलम विल बी सफिशियंट टू सॉल्व दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन
Okay, guys, see, read the question and then see. I have already uh, made the ledgers here, okay. So, how I can do it? Let's discuss this. Fatak said, discuss Kalle Tegwar. So, we have total three account. It is a branch PNL account. It's a branch stock adjustment account. Okay. So, branch stock adjustment, branch PNL we have. Okay. Branch stock adjustment, branch PNL we have. And other than this, we have. Something which is called branch stock account. Okay, branch stock account. You can write here branch stock account. Okay, uh, here you can write debit, credit, rupees. Particulars, rupees, particulars. That is what we need to do. Okay. Acha. Let's do it. Huh? Chalo. The first thing is that in the given question, if you see stock at commencement at branch at investment three lakh sixty. So stock is given three lakh sixty. Ek baar dekh lijiye. Stock is given 3,60,000 so we can directly plot it to balance BD. Correct. To balance BD 3,60,000. To balance BD 3,60,000 so we are need to plot here the at inverse phase. Okay, you can write here also in the bracket inverse phase or you can lift it out. After this stock at close at the branch at inverse phase 2,80,000. So the closing balance is 2,80,000. So you can write here by balance CYD. Two lakh eighty thousand. It's given. Okay. देखिए एक बार two lakh eighty दिया है. After that, goods sent to the branch during the year at inverse price twenty four lakh. So we don't have any problem. So we can write down two goods sent to the branch. Easily we can write it down. Two goods sent to the branch. How much? Twenty four lakh, sir. It's very easy. So उसके बाद क्या है, sir? After this, forty eight thousand is into the road. So can I write here by goods in transit? Correct. In a same line, huh? back to back, I am going to write it down. 48,000, correct. After this, <coughs> what is the information? Return of goods to HO, invest as one. It means goods sent to branch. It means the goods returned by the branch to the HO is 1,20,000. So the general entry will be GHTV account debit to branch stock account. GHTV account debit to branch stock account. So we can write here by goods sent to branch correct by group goods sent to branch you can say simply it's a one lakh twenty thousand amount correct it's a one lakh twenty thousand so this is what the what the balance we have okay after this dekhiye lig liya mene and you can write here return of goods and one thing we need to follow here that is all the adjustment i am put it here it's all on ip so we need to unload it okay that's the secondary task. We are going to do it after completing this particular account. So after the information we have, sir, you can say that is a credit sale at branch 1,20,000. So the branch credit sale is 1,20,000. So we know that, sir, in the branch stop, every adjustment is plotted. So when credit sale is happening, what happened? At that point of time, branch data account debit to branch stock. So can I write by branch data? So by branch data, how much sir? 1,20,000 is very easy. We can plot it easily. Sir, after this, what we have? Then we have sir, invoice value of goods pilfered. So it means chori ho gaya hai. It means goods pilfered means what? Goods pilfered means chori ho gaya hai. That is goods lost. So when goods pilfered, the amount is nothing but 24,000. So what is the general sir? By ab like abnormal loss account or goods pilfered account debit to branch stock. So can I write goods pilfered? Or you can write also abnormal loss. That's not a problem. Okay. So goods pilfered account is how much sir? 24,000. Correct. 
After this, after this we have normal loss at branch due to wastage is thirty six thousand. So normal loss is happen thirty six thousand. So we can write also by normal loss account thirty six thousand. Okay. After this cash seller branch. So definitely when cash seller also happening, it should have to be plotted here like by branch cash branch cash account debit to. Okay, generally it is a branch cash account debit to branch stock account because you are selling the goods, so stock will be created as stock decreases. And uh, when you sell goods and cash, so cash is coming, so branch stock account is going. Sorry, by branch cash account, it will twenty one lakh sixty thousand. Any doubt, guys? Anyone? Clear? Is pura? Perfect. So now what we need to do? We need to just close this account. Okay, close. कर लीजिए, guys. ये तो हो गया. एक कम हो गया यहाँ पे. हाँ. Okay. Just close this. क्या होगा इसमें क्लोज करने से देखिए तक बस एवरी वन सर यू कैन राइट हेयर टोटल इज अराउंड वन ट्वेंटी वन टू फोर्टी टू फोर्टी सिक्सटी थ्री लैख थ्री एंड ट्वेंटी वन सिक्सटी ट्वेंटी फोर सिक्सटी सो ट्वेंटी फोर सिक्सटी लैख प्लस फोर्टी एट थाउजेंड प्लस Two eighty-eight. It means you are getting twenty-seven lakh ninety-six thousand. Twenty-seven lakh ninety-six thousand. That is what the data we have. Okay. Now here you can have twenty twenty-seven lakh ninety-six thousand. Okay. You can write here two. Sir, uh, what we discuss in case the branch stock account is having some high side of credit balance rather than the debit balance, then it will be known as surplus of stock. It will be known as surplus of stock. Correct? Am I correct? So this is nothing but The surplus of stock, correct. So we can write here easily that surplus, or you can write here branch P and L, correct. That is what we have known. Branch profit and loss account thirty six thousand. So you can write here surplus, correct. We can easily write surplus of stock. That is what the big main fundamental. So two balance bill is three lakh sixty thousand. Two GST bill is twenty four lakh. To branch profit and loss account thirty six thousand surplus of stock. So that is the answer. Now this thirty six thousand should be transferred in the branch stock adjustment account. Correct. So here you can write by branch stock account thirty six thousand. Correct. Now this is what we have come to see. All the all the adjustment related to the sums we have covered it out. Now what we need to do? We just need to do one thing. We need to Unload all the loading included here. Correct. So in opening stock we have the balance of three lakh sixty. So here the question says, here the question says that we have something which you which you can say there is a cost plus thirty three percent. It means what do you know? Cost plus thirty three percent. It means just देखिए एक बार यहाँ पे. If you have the cost plus thirty three percent, it means cost is hundred. That we discuss correct. If your because whenever the question says that we have profit on cost, it means the parameter on which the profit will be determined. It should be taken as a hundred. So here the parameter is cost. So cost is hundred. You can say profit is nothing but thirty three point three three. Correct. So your sales become thirty one thirty three point three three. Correct. That is what the fundamental. So now if I am going to calculate, so you can say profit. Is equal to profit is equal to you can say one third of cost. Correct. Profit is equal to one third of cost. Correct. One third of cost. Profit is equal to so if profit is equal to one third of cost. So you can also cal calculate. See, it is fine. One third of cost is given because thirty three point three three percent cost plus thirty three point three three. It means a profit. The cost is basically thirty three point one third. Nothing but. Now, what will be the profit on sale? So you can write here profit on sale. देखिए कैसे कैलकुलेट होता है हाँ? Profit on sale definitely thirty three point three three is a profit divided by hundred thirty three point three three thirty three point three three divided by hundred and thirty three point three three is nothing but the one fourth correct? Is nothing but the one fourth? That is what we have done. Correct. So that is what we have. So One third of cost is nothing but the one fourth of sale similarity. So now what we are going to do it, sir? Three lakh sixty thousand is there. Three lakh sixty thousand is there, na correct? So three lakh sixty thousand is IP. 
So just try to understand. IP means what? IP means nothing but the sale value, correct? If I am going to write in a very lucid language, so the IP is not sorry. The sale price is nothing but the inverse price, correct? Sale price is nothing but the inverse price. That is going to happen. So in that case, if you see three lakh sixty thousand is what the balance you have the in terms of the stock, then definitely it is it at IP. You can also at IP. So if it is an IP, it means it is a sale price. So sell price को पर profit कितना है? How much will be the profit? Sir, one fourth definitely one fourth on sale. So can I write here? As it is in two balance BD, so definitely we have buy stock reserve. So three lakh sixty के ऊपर one fourth होने से कितना आ जाएगा ninety thousand. We are not going to stop here. We have also two GSTB. So you can write buy GSTB twenty four lakh के ऊपर. One fourth, it means six lakh, correct? Got it? This is what happened. Completed this portion. Got my point? Now after this, we have some goods sent to the branch return as well as branch data. So branch data need not to do anything else. Goods sent to the branch, goods paid for, normal loss, and also goods in transit, closing balance. So first goods sent to the branch. So one lakh twenty. So it's also an IP. So can I write here two GSTB? Sorry, two GSTB account. One lakh twenty is the amount of return which is into the IP. It will be calculated as a one fourth. So can I write it thirty thousand? Correct. Sir, after this we have some goods bill for. We have some goods bill for. So can I write goods bill for account? So in the case of goods bill for account, we have something called. Twenty four thousand, sir. Twenty four thousand is nothing but one fourth because twenty four thousand is an IP, so it will be six thousand, sir. Done. Another thing is done. After this, sir, we have you can say normal loss. So, sir, two normal loss. Okay. So, normal loss is having we have thirty six thousand. Correct. Normal loss we have thirty six. And now, guys, I am requesting everyone to check first the normal loss entry. Look, guys, this is the most important thing, guys. It's very very important. Just try to understand how the normal loss will be treated. Okay, let's look into this. Take care, guys. Normal loss ka journal dekh lijiye, guys. Please. In case of normal loss, the journal will be branch adjustment account debit to branch stock. Sir, branch adjustment to branch stock means full normal loss will be transferred to the branch adjustment. No such other entry required. Rather, full adjustments regarding the normal loss should be transferred to the branch adjustment. So in that given case, if you check it, so can I write here, sir, two normal loss, fully thirty six thousand, or we can have a general entry, sir, two branch stock, and there you can also make two branch stock rather than it. It will give you more clarity. Okay, you can write this a normal loss thirty six thousand, and here you can write rather than normal loss, you can write here buy branch adjustment. Okay. By branch adjustment account, so you can plot a normal loss. So rather plotting by normal loss, rather you can show the general entry properly. So branch adjustment account debit to branch stock at inverse price. So here is the by branch adjustment thirty six thousand normal loss, and here in that case two branch stock thirty six thousand. Other than this, we have goods in transit. So can you write here two goods in transit? So sir, we have you can write total forty eight thousand. In which one fourth profit is included because it's all our IP. So twelve thousand. Two stock reserve. We have some. We have something called stock reserve. So this stock reserve belongs to the closing stock in hand. So two lakh eighty eight. के ऊपर one fourth करेंगे हम लोग. Two lakh eighty eight thousand into one fourth. How much it will be, sir? Two lakh eighty eight के ऊपर one fourth करेंगे तो कितना हो जाएगा? बोलिए. So if I am going to do it, two lakh eighty eight thousand. So it will be seventy two thousand. Okay, ha seventy two thousand. So it will be done, sir. No problem at all. Now what we need to do? Everything has been so. Never ever plot the profit on the surplus. So the surplus is a different thing. We have already transferred it. Okay. So just now try to close it out. You have something called seven lakh twenty six thousand in the trade side. Correct. Seven lakh twenty six thousand. Now plus minus. करने से कितना आता है देखिए seven twenty six minus ninety six. Okay. Seven twenty six minus ninety six thousand minus seventy two twelve. अच्छा ये eighty four होगा ना sorry guys. 
ये एट्टी फोर थाउजेंड है माइनस थर्टी सिक्स प्लस सिक्स फोर्टी टू एंड सेवेंटी टू माइनस सेवेंटी टू थाउजेंड सो वी हैव फाइव लैक सेवेंटी ओके माइनस सेवन टू सिक्स अच्छा सो वी हैव बैलेंस फाइव लैक सेवेंटी थाउजेंड सेवेंटी थाउजेंड सो वी हैव द बैलेंस ऑफ फाइव लैक सेवेंटी टू थाउजेंड करेक्ट सो यू कैन एक टू ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस यू कैन राइट है टू ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस करेक्ट जीपी करेक्ट सो कैन आई राइट इजिली टू ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट ओके टू ब्रांच प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट फाइव लैक सेवेंटी थाउजेंड इट्स अ जीपी नथिंग बट इट्स अ जीपी करेक्ट सो हेयर यू कैन राइट बाय बाय ब्रांच एडजस्टमेंट अकाउंट फाइव लैक सेवेंटी थाउजेंड ओके इट्स अ जीपी ट्रांसफर करेक्ट इट्स अ जीपी ट्रांसफर दैट इज वॉट वी हैव डन सर नाउ लेट से फाइव लैक सेवेंटी थाउजेंड ओके यू कैन राइट है बट आफ्टर दिस वॉट वी नीड टू डू वी नीड टू डू एंड कंप्लीट द ब्रांच पी एन एल नाउ वॉट विल बी द जनरल इंटरव्यू इन द ब्रांच पी एन जस्ट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड ओके नाउ कम टू हेयर ओके नाउ जस्ट सी हेयर हा दिस जनरल इंटरव्यू दैट ओनली वन थिंग वी हैव इन केस ऑफ एबनॉर्मल लॉस ऑफ स्टॉक वॉट इज जनरल इंटरव्यू इन केस ऑफ पील फोरेज ब्रांच एडजस्टमेंट अकाउंट डेबिट ब्रांच पी एन अकाउंट डेबिट टू ब्रांच स्टॉक ब्रांच एडजस्टमेंट डेबिट इट्स ओनली द लोडिंग सो इन केस देर इज एनी एबनॉर्मल लॉस इज है इन द ब्रांच स्टॉक अकाउंट वी नीड टू पुट the inverse price in the branch stock account we need to plot the inverse price but in case of the branch adjustment we need to plot the loading part in case of branch adjustment we need to plot the loading because it's obviously it's a nothing but the nominal account so in the nominal account we are going to plot only the profit part but in case of the branch profit loss account we are going to plot the cost part because it's a branch loss that's why the loading itself adjusted against the branch adjustment but in case of the cost of that particular goods it will be adjusted against the branch profit and loss account so here if if you can see the total abnormal loss we have 24000 correct and the loading we have in the branch abnormal loss 6000 so can i write here the balance will be two branch stock account can i write two branch stock account definitely the cost will be form part of this so 24000 is the ip minus 6000 is the cost by so here you have 18000 Done, sir. Now we don't have anything else. So can we close this particular account? Yes. Why not, sir? So you can write here, sir. Net profit CD. Correct. You have something called five lakh sixty. Ah, sorry, fifty two thousand. So that is we have closed, sir. Done. Very easy, sir. Correct. So this is what we have done. See, May eighteen में जिन जिन लोगों का ये question आता है, उन लोगों का luck बहुत अच्छा था. Very good luck. बहुत इजी वाला क्वेश्चन है कुछ झमला ही नहीं है इतना इजी है क्या बताएंगे कुछ बोलने का ही नहीं बहुत 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 इजी है ठीक है इट्स अ वेरी इजी क्वेश्चन ठीक है ना चलो अब आगे बढ़ते हैं गाइस ठीक है नाउ लेट्स डू वन क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द अच्छा कम टू क्वेश्चन नंबर कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल ट्वेंटी नाइन ओके कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल ट्वेंटी नाइन में आ जाइए वो एक बार हम लोग देख लेते हैं कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल ट्वेंटी नाइन ठीक है ये तब तक कॉपी कर लीजिए जिन जिनका कॉपी नहीं हुआ है ओके and then we are going to move to the next question that is concept capsule 29 okay
कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल ट्वेंटी नाइन ओके कम टू कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल ट्वेंटी नाइन लेट्स गो थ्रू इट ओके चलिए मल्टी चेन स्टोर लिमिटेड दिल्ली हैज इट्स ब्रांचेस ओके एट लखनऊ एंड चेन्नई इट चार्जेस गुड्स टू इट ब्रांचेस एट कॉस्ट प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट इट मीन गुड्स हेज बीन सेंड टू द ब्रांच एट ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट प्रॉफिट ऑन कॉस्ट मीन्स कॉस्ट इज हंड्रेड शुड बी टेकन प्रॉफिट ट्वेंटी फाइव सो यूर इनवर्स प्राइस विल बी हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव करेक्ट फॉलोइंग इन्फॉर्मेशन इज अवेलेबल ऑफ द ट्रांजेक्शन ऑफ द लखनऊ ब्रांच फॉर द इयर इन थर्टी फर्स्ट मार्च टू थाउजेंड जीरो एट सो द इन्फॉर्मेशन गिवेन इट इज प्योरली बेस्ड ऑन द ट्रांजेक्शन इन लखनऊ ब्रांच ओके बैलेंस ऑन वन फोर टू थाउजेंड सेवन इज गिवेन स्टॉक थर्टी थाउजेंड डेटा टेन थाउजेंड पेटी एक्सपेंसिस पेटी गैस फिफ्टी थाउजेंड फिफ्टी रुपीज करेक्ट ट्रांजेक्शन ड्यूरिंग द टू थाउजेंड सेवन एट लखनऊ ब्रांच नाउ डेट इज गिवेन गुड सेंड टू लखनऊ ब्रांच एट इनवर्स प्राइस थ्री लैख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड आई एम रिपीटिंग गाइज गुड सेंड टू द लखनऊ ब्रांच एट इनवर्स प्राइस थ्री लैख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड ओके गुड सेंड टू द लखनऊ ब्रांच एट इनवर्स प्राइस थ्री लैख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड ठीक है गुड्स रिटर्न टू एच एच ओ एट इनवर्स प्राइस टेन थाउजेंड गुड्स रिटर्न टू देड ऑफ इज एट इनवर्स प्राइस टेन थाउजेंड कैश सेल इज वन लैख रुपीज क्रेडिट सेल इज वन लैख सेवेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड गुड्स पेल फॉर इनवर्स प्राइस इज टू थाउजेंड गुड्स लॉस्ट इन फायर इनवर्स प्राइस इज फाइव थाउजेंड ओके नाउ कैश सेंड फॉर पेटी एक्सपेंसिस थर्टी फोर थाउजेंड बैड डेटर ब्रांच फाइव हंड्रेड गुड्स ट्रांसफर टू चेन्नई ब्रांच अंडर एच ओ इन एडवाइस फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड इंश्योरेंस चार्जेस बाय पेड बाई एच ओ फाइव हंड्रेड गुड्स रिटर्न बाई डेटर फाइव हंड्रेड इंश्योरेंस कंपनी पेड टू एच ओ फॉर लॉस बाई फायर एट लखनऊ थ्री थाउजेंड वेरी गुड सो फ्रॉम दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इफ यू कैन सी द बॉक्स इट सेल इन द बॉक्स वी हैव मल्टीपल इन्फॉर्मेशन ओके इन द बॉक्स वी हैव द मल्टीपल इन्फॉर्मेशन द फर्स्ट वेरी मच इन्फॉर्मेशन इज दैट दैट द डिफिकल्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन इज दैट गुड्स पिल फॉर टू थाउजेंड गुड्स लॉस्ट इन फायर फाइव थाउजेंड सो टोटल गुड्स लॉस्ट ड्यू टू द एबनॉर्मेलिटी सेवन थाउजेंड करेक्ट ऑल आर गिवेन इनवर्स प्राइस नाउ आफ्टर दिस वी हैव समथिंग कॉल बैड डेट विच इज इन वेरी इजी बट अदर देन दिस the important information is that insurance charges paid by the ho 500 okay so this is uh, so much fine not a uh, tough at all acha one more thing insurance company paid ho for loss by fire lagnau see the very much uh, very much last adjustment in the box it's given insurance company paid to ho for loss by fire at lagnau 3000 insurance company paid to ho so insurance company ne kisko pay kiya ho ko for loss by fire at lagnau 3000 got it Now balance on thirty first March two thousand eight, petty cash two thirty, debtor fourteen thousand, goods or rupees fifteen thousand included above, sent by Lucknow branch at Chennai branch was in transit on thirty first March two thousand eight. I am repeating guys, goods or fifteen thousand included above, sent by Lucknow branch at Chennai branch. Okay, so goods or how much fifteen thousand sent by who? Lucknow branch ne Chennai branch ko sent ke was in transit on. Thirty-first March two thousand eight. So the following accounts in the books of Multi Chain Store Limited. So the following accounts in the books of Multi Chain Store Limited. Lucknow Branch Stock Account, Lucknow Branch Data Account, Lucknow Branch Adjustment Account, Lucknow Branch Profit and Loss Account, Stock Reserve Account. I am repeating, guys. Lucknow Branch Stock Account, Lucknow Branch Data Account, Lucknow Branch Adjustment Account, Lucknow Branch Profit and Loss Account, Stock Reserve Account, and Goods Sent to the Lucknow Branch Account. So these are the basic few information. Acha guys, sorry. these are very basic information that you need to give. see the question is very easy the most important thing is that this one is little bit of things that we need to just go through it okay that is not so much tough okay and other than this we have little bit far information so it's a very easy but the difficulty is that we need to prepare six account that is what the difficult other than the question is very easy believe me this types of question can be formed in the exam okay other than question is very easy so bas tough wahi cheez hai ke sir mujhe इतना सारा चीज करने पड़ेंगे सो गाइस आई एम स्टार्टिंग द क्वेश्चन ओके एवरीवन प्लीज रीड इट तब तक मैं थोड़ा फॉर्मेट ए कर लेता हूं फॉर्मेट को थोड़ा मेंटेन कर लेता हूं कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल 29 कॉन्सेप्ट कैप्सूल 29 ओके छह टोटल अकाउंट बनाने हैं तो आप छह अकाउंट मेंटेन कर वाली एग्जाम में गाइस नीड टू मेंटेन अकाउंट प्रॉपर्ली हां डोंट डू लाइक एनी टी सेफ्स एक्सेट्रा इट विल मार्क्स डिडक्टेड हाईली सो मेंटेन अकाउंट प्रॉपर्ली
Everything we have prepared, okay? Lucknow branch stock account, we have already prepared. So, particular CK, rupees, short me likhte haan, to save your time. Okay? And now, start it to fill it up, okay? Achha guys, sabse important baat jo hai, dekhe, if you see the question here, first question, that is the company send the goods to its Chennai branch and Lucknow branch at cost plus 25%. So, can we write here like this? If, if you can see, ऐसे क्या लिख सकते हैं हम लोग देखिए तो गैस, if your, if you can say the cost is your, if cost is hundred, then profit is nothing but twenty five. We can easily write it down. So IP is nothing but your one two five correct. That is what we have. So IP is one two five. So can I write here? Uh, profit is equal to 25 by 100 on cost means one fourth on cost if I wanted to write down the IP it means profit on IP okay profit on IP so can I write 25 by 125 equal to one fifth on IP correct that is very true so see if you do these things before starting the question, it will be like crystal and clear water for you. All the water comes to you and you need to just freshly take out from this and start your working on that part. Okay, that is like uh, workings related to that cost, profit and IP part. Okay, 
make it very very much clear so the very first thing that we have in the given question if you just go through it and check it see here if the given question is given balance on the 1st of april 2007 stock data and petty cash is given okay so what we need to do we just need to go through once the lucknow branch stock account okay लखनऊ ब्रांच तक स्टॉक अकाउंट में जाएंगे हम लोग और यहाँ पे क्या प्लॉट करेंगे आज देखिए सो टू बैलेंस बी डी वी कैन राइट हेयर टू बैलेंस बी वाई डी हाउ मच मनी सर थर्टी थाउजेंड करेक्ट दैट इज ऑफ दर्टी थाउजेंड मनी इट्स गिवन इन द क्वेश्चन एंड डेटर वी हैव टेन थाउजेंड बैलेंस सो गो टू द डेटर एंड प्लॉट इट टू बैलेंस बी डी इट्स अ डेबिट साइट हाउ मच यू नीड टू इन्वेस्ट सर आई नीड टू इन्वेस्ट नथिंग बट द टेन थाउजेंड करेक्ट Okay, so ten thousand. That is what we have. After this, we have the PT cash balance. So PT cash means something called we have the balance. Okay, so can I can I write like PT cash balance? We have only rupees fifty rupees. Correct. Only we have the fifty rupees in the PT cash account. So that is okay, fine, no problem at all. So you can also maintain some uh, PT cash account itself. Okay, for our sake of convenience, we can also do that. Okay. So चलिए एक दो तीन चार पांच तो हो ही गया. इन्फॉर्मेश सबसे पहले गुड सेंड टू द लखनऊ ब्रांच एट आई पी थ्री लाख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड सो कैन यू राइट लाइक दिस जी एस टी बी थ्री लाख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड करेक्ट सो वी आर गोइंग टू राइट जी एस टी बी थ्री लाख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड सो हेयर यू कैन राइट टू जी एस टी बी ओके गुड सेंड टू द ब्रांच थ्री लाख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड सर आफ्टर दिस वी हैव गुड्स रिटर्न टू एच ओ ऑफिस एट इनवर्स प्राइस दैट इज नथिंग बट द टेन थाउजेंड सो कैन यू राइट बाई Good sent to branch. You can write here return. Correct. Ten thousand. I can write it easily. Perfect. Done. After this, we have cash sale one lakh rupees. So we have the cash sale. So cash sale generally is nothing but the what? Cash sale is one lakh rupees. So cash sale means branch cash account debit to branch stock account. So by Lucknow branch cash account. How much one lakh rupees? Got it, sir. Done. After this, we have credit sale. So credit sale means branch debtor account debit to stock. So Lucknow branch debtor account. You can write here. It's a credit sale entry, and the amount of credit sale is nothing but how much, sir? One lakh seventy five thousand is given, sir, in the question clearly. Perfect. After this, we have goods pilfered inverse price two thousand and goods lost by fire five thousand. So can you write here like this? Goods. Pilford account goods lost by fire account. So we have two thousand here. We have five thousand here. That is the two option that we have. Correct. That is the two option that we have. There is a very much two option we have. Correct. So other than this, what we have? Cash sent for PT expenses thirty four thousand. Cash sent for PT expenses thirty four thousand. It means H O sent some cash. For the purpose of PT cash, correct. For the purpose of PT cash, so this is thirty-four thousand is sent by the H O. So how to record this thirty-four thousand is very easy. So when you are going to record this thirty-four thousand, you can easily record. See PT cash sent by the H O for the PT cash expense. So can you write here PT cash account when H O sent any cash to you in terms of PT cash in nothing but the cash received from the H O. So when you receive the cash from the H O, so your PT cash will go increase. So can I write here two cash account? Can I write here thirty four thousand? It means this much amount you have received from the H O. Correct. You can write here received from H O. Done, hai, sir. Completed. After this, what information we have? Uh, we have the information regarding bad data branch. So bad data definitely plotted at the Lucknow branch data account. Correct. 
बैटरी भी प्लॉट रहे इट्स वेरी इजी सो ब्रांच डेटा में हम लोग बैड डेट प्लॉट करेंगे सो बैड डेट हाउ मच सर फाइव हंड्रेड कर बैड डेट इज नथिंग बट द फाइव हंड्रेड सो इट इज नथिंग बट द ब्रांच एक्सपेंसेस करेक्ट सो बैड डेट का जनरल क्या होता है सर सर बैड डेट एंड डिस्काउंट अलाउट द जनरल विल बी बैड डेट ब्रांच एक्सपेंस अकाउंट डेबिट टू ब्रांच डेटर दैट इज अ जनरल करेक्ट सर बैड डेट और डिस्काउंट अलाउट ब्रांच एक्सपेंस अकाउंट डेबिट टू ब्रांच डेटर सो कैन आई राइट हेयर बाय ब्रांच एक्सपेंसेस टू रिकॉर्ड द बैड डेट Five hundred. That is done, sir. After this, what we have the information? After this, we have the information. Goods transferred to Chennai branch under H O advice. So goods transferred to Chennai. It is nothing but the goods transferred by the H O. Sorry, by the branch. So uh, uh, what we have learned? Either goods returned by the branch to H O, or goods returned. Sorry, or goods transferred to another branch. The journal entry remain the same. The journal entry remain the same. It's very easy. So guys, try to understand when goods returned by the branch to H O, the journal will be GST B account debit to branch to. In the similar way, when goods has been transferred from your branch to the another branch, then the journal will remain the same GST B account debit to branch to account. So can I write here GST B account debit to GST B account debit to branch to account? So can I write here by GST B account? Transfer to Chennai branch. How much sir is that? Fifteen thousand, correct? That is what we have. Acha sir, ये तो हो गया पूरा चीज़. Now the second information we have that insurance charges paid by H O five hundred. So insurance charges paid by whom? It's the H O paid by the H O simply. So when insurance charges paid by H O, so definitely it will be treated in the branch P N L account, correct? इन द ब्रांच पेन सो गाइस ब्रांच पेन में चलिए एक बार गो टू द ब्रांच पेन सो ब्रांच पेन इज दैट दिस वन सो हियर यू जस्ट सिंपली नोटेड डाउन हाउ टू प्लॉट इट डेबिट एंड क्रेडिट सो इन दैट गिवन केस सी हियर इज द ब्रांच एक्सपेंसेस 500 डेबिट सो यू कैन डू इट लाइक दिस हियर टू ब्रांच डेटर 500 सॉरी यस यहां पे लिखना है आपको लखनऊ हाँ टू इंश्योरेंस चार्जेस 500 करेक्ट इट्स अ पीएल अकाउंट टू इंश्योरेंस चार्जेस अकाउंट 500 पीएल अकाउंट करेक्ट सो दिस इज ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन दैट वी हैव टू ब्रांच डेटर टू इंश्योरेंस चार्जेस दैट यू हैव डन नाउ आफ्टर दिस व्हाट इंफॉर्मेशन वी हैव आफ्टर दिस वी हैव गुड्स रिटर्न बाय डेटर सो वेन गुड्स रिटर्न बाय द डेटर द जन एंड विल बी The journal entry will be what branch stock account debit to branch stock account debit to branch data correct. So branch stock account debit to branch data account correct. So can I write here by branch stock return by data? You can write here return by data. How much we have? We have something called the balance is return by the data is. 500 sir, plot here 500 done sir. So this entry will be plotted in the branch stock account itself. So can you write here branch stock to branch data to Lucknow done sir completed. So these two has already been completed. After this what we have sir we have some call insurance company paid to H O for loss of by fire at Lucknow. so insurance company paid some amount to the branch for the loss so when insurance company pay some amount it should have to be adjusted again where any insurance company paid something amount then definitely it should be adjusted again the branch pnl correct branch pnl me adjustment karna hai abhi nahi right now we are not going to do anything is after certain point of time we are going to adjust it okay so the last adjustment related to uh, related to this the last adjustment related to this Is still pending. Insurance company just now pay kiya. Acha guys, balance dekhiye. Petty cash we having a balance of two thirty and data we have the balance of one lakh uh, sorry fourteen thousand. So these two have the balance. So data ke balance ab jaake bata dijiye fourteen thousand closing balance hai. So can I write here? Buy balance CD correct fourteen thousand and we have the closing balance in the petty cash buy. 
बैलेंस ई वाई डी हाउ मच इज द बैलेंस वी हैव सम कॉल टू थर्टी रुपीज ऑफ बैलेंस ओके नो आफ्टर दिस वॉट इन्फॉर्मेशन वी हैव वी हैव सम इन्फॉर्मेशन विच इज कॉल्ड सर गुड्स ओवर द फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड इंक्लूडेड अब ऑफ सेंट बाय लखनऊ ब्रांच एट चेन्नई ब्रांच वॉज इन ट्रांसिट ऑन इकतीस तीन दो हजार सो द गुड्स ट्रांसफर गुड्स ट्रांसफर बाय द जस्ट आई टू गुड्स ट्रांसफर बाय द लखनऊ ब्रांच टू द चेन्नई ब्रांच इज स्टील इन गुड्स इन ट्रांसिट करेक्ट स्टील इन गुड्स इन ट्रांसिट सो जस्ट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द गुड्स ट्रांसफर बाय द जीएसटी ब्रांच टू द चेन्नई इन ट्रांसिट सो वे दैट आई नीड टू रिकॉर्ड सेपरेटली एनीथिंग एल्स Regarding this fifteen thousand, I don't think so, because see, when goods has been transferred, goods has been transferred to the another branch, then the the branch which has is which is going to receive the goods, he will take care of the things because already we have sent na. If it is in transit, it is not our problem. Like let's say we have already transferred. So when we have already transferred the goods and it is in transit, the receiving branch will record the transit entry, not mine, because the goods has been already been gone from my hand. Correct. it is already deliver it is already out of my hand so it will be recorded as a transit by the chennai head of uh, branch only correct now let's say uh, we have already adjusted all the entry that is required basically here correct we have already plotted all the adjustment entries now uh, one thing also we have some branch data entry 175 to so regarding the credit cell so credit cell ka entry aap bata dijiye guys to Branch stock account one lakh seventy five thousand correct. So just now check it out. What are the balance we have left regarding this? Kya balance bacha hai? Bo dekh lijiye guys. Guys, you have plotted everything here. But see, in the branch stock account, you don't have any closing balance. Correct? Am I correct or wrong? You don't have any closing balance. So what do we need to do? We need to calculate the closing balance. The question itself given like that, the balance you will going to calculate from the Lucknow branch stock. Is nothing but the closing balance. So the question is very tricky. Correct. So here you need to calculate the closing balance of the branch stock account. So just calculate this. चलिए calculate करके देख लेते हैं क्या कितना होता है. Thirty three lakh twenty five three five hundred. So you can say three fifty five five hundred. Correct. Three fifty five five hundred. So minus from here three fifty five five hundred से minus करके देख लीजिए बोलिए इस कितना होता है. Three fifty five five hundred minus Ten thousand minus one lakh ah one lakh nee two lakh seventy five thousand these two addition कर देते हैं एक साथ में हो जाएगा minus two thousand five thousand seven thousand and fifteen मतलब twenty two thousand so we have amount of forty eight five hundred correct forty eight five hundred is a closing balance so it's forty eight five hundred is a balance done sir complete sir so this is what we have done so you can write here balancing figure. कंप्लीटेड सर सो जैसे हो जाएगा सर दो मार्क्स तो पक्की है सर अपना दो मार्क्स पक्की है सर एकदम से इसके बाद सर वी आर गोइंग टू क्लोज दिस पर्टिकुलर सी एवरी बैलेंस वी हैव नाउ फ्रॉम हियर यू कैन इजीली गेट द अमाउंट ऑफ मनी यू रिसीव फ्रॉम द डेटा सी इन द ब्रांच डेटा अकाउंट जस्ट ऑब्जर्व एवरी एडजस्टमेंट इज देयर बट द कैश रिसीव फ्रॉम द ब्रांच इज मिसिंग सो वी कैन इजीली कैलकुलेट बाय ब्रांच बाय व्हाट यू नीड टू राइट बाय क्या लिखने बोली कैसे करना है इसको बाय क्या एनी मनी दैट यू आर गोइंग टू रिसीव फ्रॉम दैट पर्टिकुलर डेटर इट शुड हैव टू बी बाय ब्रांच कैसे यू कैन राइट सो हियर द डू द बैलेंस 185 लाख 185 लाख माइनस 14000 1000 सो वी हैव 170000 so this much of money you have received from the return so see guys take a pen and write it down balancing figure amount collected from data correct amount collected from the data that is what the main thing now that is completed sir branch adjustment pura baki hai sir full definitely so what we need to do we need to do the branch adjustment first so guys first of all just plot all the adjustment related to the ip price okay whatever the adjustment we have in the it price see just i told you one by one balance bd opening stock 30000 so it is in the 
like IP, it is in IP. So from here, stock reserve to be uh, like uh, adjusted in the branch adjustment. Here, GSTB, it's also IP to be adjusted, correct? And other than this, GSTB return also adjusted, okay? And then you have goods pilfer to be adjusted, goods loss to be to be adjusted, and also GSTB means goods transfer to the Chennai branch also adjusted along with the balance, closing balance. So multiple adjustments there. Now I am doing one by one. You just see and watch, okay? And note it down. Okay, कैसे करते एक-एक करके. सबसे पहले opening stock reserve है. So buy. So buy opening stock reserve you can write. So you can write stock reserve. हाँ, don't plot any opening and closing because stock reserve account you need to prepare. So stock reserve में कितना होगा सर? We have the opening stock reserve thirty thousand, correct? And we have calculated all what? सर आई पी इज वन फिफ्थ ऑन आई पी प्रॉफिट इज वन फिफ्थ ऑन आई पी सो थर्टी थाउजेंड को वन फिफ्थ करना है सर कितना आएगा सिक्स थाउजेंड करेक्ट बिकॉज द अमाउंट इज गिवेन इन आई पी ना दर्टी थाउजेंड इज गिवेन इन आई पी सो वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट बेस्ड ऑन द आई पी ओनली आफ्टर दिस वट वी हैव सर बाई गुड्स सेंड टू द ब्रांच ऑरिजिनल थ्री लैख ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड इसका वन फिफ्थ करेंगे तो कितना आ जाएगा सर 65,000 करेक्ट आफ्टर दिस सर वी हैव द रिटर्न ऑफ गुड्स सो जीएसटीबी अकाउंट रिटर्न सर रिटर्न इज हाउ मच 10,000 थाउजेंड इन टू वन फिफ्थ मीन्स टू थाउजेंड टू आफ्टर दिस वी हैव गुड्स पिल फॉर हाउ मच वी हैव 2,000 थाउजेंड इन टू वन फिफ्थ फोर हंड्रेड वी हैव गुड्स लॉस्ट बाई फायर So in the case of goods lost by fire, we have five thousand into one fifth. That is a thousand. Then after this, we have stock reserve. So it's a clothing stock reserve. So we have forty-eight five hundred into one fifth. So kidna hoga bolye forty-eight five hundred ka one fifth karenge to nine seven hundred. Okay. Nine seven hundred. That is what the balance we have. Done, sir. After this, what we have? The last thing is that Chennai transfer. I have already said. I have said. Two GSTB goods sent to Chennai. You can see GSTC will be there. You can write from us. Chennai can be written from us. So Chennai, how much have I sent? Fifteen thousand. One fifth means three thousand. Now everything is done. Now get the. Branch profit and loss account. That is nothing but the gross profit. You can say what will be the balance we have? Seventy one thousand in that case. Seventy one minus two thousand sixty nine. Sixty nine minus twelve. Carrying the fifty seven three hundred fifty seven three hundred minus four hundred fifty six nine hundred and fifty six nine hundred minus this. Uh, oh, oh, calculation. And the last thing. Yeah, I will see how much. I think so. Fifty-five thousand something will come. So seventy-one thousand minus we have two thousand four hundred. Okay. Minus we have thirteen thousand seven hundred. So we have fifty-four nine hundred is a balance. Okay. So this fifty-four nine hundred is a balancing figure, correct? So you can write here. It's a balancing figure, correct? So can I write here? This one is the nothing but the gross profit. This is nothing but the gross profit. Correct. We can write it easily. So this is how we can write seventy one thousand. Correct. Seventy one thousand. That we can write here easily. So now after this, what we need to go through it. It's a Lucknow branch and profit and loss account. Lucknow branch and profit and loss account. So see guys, we just need to transfer by. Lucknow branch adjustment account fifty four nine hundred correct. So after this, what we have to uh, done here? See guys, we have already discussed that any goods, okay, which has been damaged or pilfered or lost due to fire or any other things, which is in the nature of abnormal, all the cost should be plotted in the branch PL account correct. All the cost should be plotted branch PL account. So the goods pilfered. And the goods lost by fire. These two entries cost part will be recorded here. So can I write here two 
you can write to branch stock account correct now try to understand very very carefully sir sabse pehle to uh, goods bill for 2000 goods last wife 5000 so total amount is 6000 sorry 7000 correct and what is the loading or the profit sir in the case of goods bill for 400 in the case of goods last wife 1000 so it means sir 400 plus 1000 so 7000 minus 1400 it means nothing but 5600 correct so this is what the cost that we need to record so you can write here easily cost of goods lost correct that is what we can write here easily very easily now after this at what we have after this we have some uh, let's say other than this sir petty cash need to be closed because ho send you 34000 now see how you can justify all of the things opening cash petty cash you have 50 rupees HO sends you 34,000 and the closing petty cash balance you have 230. So it means how much money you have received. Sorry, how much money you have spent? How much money you have spent? So you have spent 34,050 minus 230 because this is nothing but the closing balance still in your hand and this is what the total balance in your hand in, in terms of the cash. So can I write buy branch profit and loss account? What will the balance here? After this, if you plus minus it, so you can have 34,050, 180. So 33, 120, 33. We can write here 820 rupees, correct? That is what the balance left. So it's 34,050. So can you write here? Easily. It's a balancing figure. It's the expenses made by branch correct this is what the original expense made by the branch so can i write here like this uh, branch pnm will accept the get to petty cash account petty cash expenses account how much is that 33 820 now match it you can get the net profit easily 54 900 54 900 minus 1000 this 2000 minus 5600 minus 33820 14480 correct that is what we have done 14480 that is what we have done it's clear sir ekdam ekdam pakka clear hai koi problem nahi isme samajhne mein ekdam ekdam easy hai sir there is no problem at all it's very 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 easy so can i write here 2 net profit cd you can see it's a balancing figure fifty four nine hundred. correct now let's close the stock reserve first so we have the two stock reserve here and also here so it's six thousand is nine thousand seven hundred so just plot it in the stock reserves account correct here six thousand and is a nine thousand seven hundred so can you plot like this so in that case in the case of stock reserve you can easily say two branch adjustment account 6000 by branch adjustment account 9700 so these are the two balance that we have so can we say that we have the opening balance of stock reserve. So just try to understand and focus on it. The opening balance of stock reserve we have how much? By balance BYD. So the opening balance of stock reserve how much? So 6000 definitely. See this is the balance transfer from the branch adjustment account. But in the opening stock how much is the total stock reserve we have? 6000. How much is the total stock reserve we have? 6000. So that is why buy and is very 6000. And in the closing case, how much is the stock balance we have in the sense of stock reserve? Sorry, stock reserve we have in the sense of stock. So you can say two, two balance CYD is you can say 9700. This is the branch adjustment through record and this is what the closing stock reserve you had. So this will match in both the side. Got it? 
so when you are going to do branch stock reserves account please try to understand branch edges means separate part branch edges means separate part and when all the edges will be going to run then buy balance bid is the opening stock reserve two balance bid is a closing stock reserve that you need to plot here correct now good send to gb uh, so lagno branch so you can write here buy branch stock account how much money it will have physically good send to that so we'll add 25000 Correct. Other than this, what is the amount of uh, like goods return to Lucknow branch stock? Sorry, Lucknow. Write now, guys. Lucknow branch stock account. What is the amount we have already transferred? So, if you can check, the amount of transfer is nothing but the ten thousand rupees. Correct. Okay, done. And after this, sir. After this goods sent to branch, what will happen? Guys, obviously in that case, transfer to your Chennai branch. So can you write here two uh, goods? Can you write like two, like uh, branch? Okay, you can write branch stock account. Okay, Lucknow branch stock account. How much, sir? Fifteen thousand. You can write here sent to Chennai branch. Sent to Chennai branch easily. Perfect. Now after this, what we have? See here, it is sixty-five thousand. Good send to the branch sixty-five thousand. Good send to the two thousand. Here it is. Uh, all the loadings we have. So now can I write like this? Dekhiye toh ek baar guys. Kitna kitna hoga? Dekh lijiye ha guys. Now in that case, see good send to the branch sixty-five thousand. It means this is the loading part. So loading part should be unloaded here. Plotted also here. So you can write here to Lucknow. Branch adjustment account, correct. It's easy. See, it's nothing but the transferring of the adjustment. You need to just keep in mind all the adjustments will be transferred from one account to the another account. That is what the simplification of that. Okay, not any dullness at all. Now, Lucknow branch goods sent. How much did it do? Lucknow branch sent how much goods sent? Obviously, goods sent basically. Mm -mm, this is two thousand, correct? Look here, guys. Here, look here. In the debit side, which balance you have? This two thousand. And the goods sent to the Chennai branch, the loading also to be there three thousand. So both the entry has been made with respect to the goods sent to the branch. So two thousand and three thousand, both the entries will be plotted here. So you can write here by Lucknow branch adjustment account. Lucknow branch adjustment account. How much, sir? Two thousand for the stock return in uh, profit and three thousand in the Is the Chennai stocks transfer profit? So five thousand is total correct. So now, if we are going to close it out, it is nothing but three lakh thirty thousand, and here it is three lakh thirty thousand. Now plus minus this, you are going to get. See, as the company is a, as the company you can say as a company is uh, engaging in the manufacturing. See, the nothing, uh, not so much information is given. Rather, they have given that it charges goods to its branch. So I think I am presuming that it is a manufacturing company. So goods sent to the branch will be closed as a trading account. Okay, if it is not a manufacturing company, then it will be purchase account. So as all the information is given and based upon which we are understanding that this is nothing but the manufacturing company, so we can calculate this as a two trading account. So two trading account, how much will be? Add the value of sixty-five, five, fifteen, eighty, and ninety. Ninety is three twenty. What is it? Two forty. Okay. 240. That is what we have done. Complete it, sir. This is what we have done. 2 lakh 40 thousand. ठीक है? Easy the question. बाकी सब question मिल चुका है. So that is how. See, we have done a very big question. We have done a very very big question. Okay, say concept capsule 29. We have done it. So this is how the stock and data system should be represented and stock and data system should be calculated. Okay. So I am requesting everyone, please go through this particular topic very consciously because from here. You can at least expect some question from me. Okay, it's true. Believe me, it's true. It will, it will definitely come. So you jo, uh, just don't uh, make the mistake of not doing it. Okay, it's sure you are going to come. It will 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 come. It
the concept capsule that I have already given earlier along with this concept capsule too you need to do it as a homework okay now what I am going to do I am just writing out in the uh, whatsapp that which questions you need to do right now okay okay and please try to do it because if you are not understanding this it will not make any fruitful to you actually okay you can do it but it will not make anything as justifiable to you that's what my request okay na chale karte ek bar okay it will going to do it aap log kar lijiye aur aap log next class mein final account method karenge okay thank you guys have a very good night bye